I gotta catch this before it quits. It's about ready to quit. Oh, it just quit. Hopefully y'all seen it. In the sun, that aerator works because it's solar. Uh, that's how I've got it hooked up anyway. I got a little 35 amp hour AGM battery hooked up to a couple hundred watts of solar. I think the battery's burnt, but when the sun's out, she runs. I'm just on my way down here to feed the fish. I figured I'd take you guys along. I'll be right back. We're gonna feed the fish. Water's good and cleared up. I think them turtles are really messing things up. Gotta get them drugged out. See what happens here. So I've got a I don't want to say it real loud. I got bass and bluegill in here. And uh, eventually this pond is going to be turned into a... Uh... Oh shoot. I got the aerator in. I'm going to put a pump in. And we're going to put a aquaponics bed up there. As soon as we get all my solar done. It's going to be next year probably. But that's how we're going to do it. I imagine... Aquaponics out of this pond should turn out pretty good. But yeah, that's what we're doing with it. It's going to take a little time. But yep, here's my update on the solar pond. DIY Solar Homestead. I hope you're watching. I'm going to try to get some underwater views as soon as the water clears up. If it does this year. Might do a thing on the Jugging them turtles out. I know I got at least two in there. <clears throat> some more food here. Oh, the babies are eating. So, yeah, I noticed I had baby bass this year too, so that kind of tickled me. I started out with like, I think, six or eight bass. But now I got some about three to four inches long. But, uh, yeah, that's the update. Aquaponics next year. Running through there. Clean up the water even more. And uh, supply me uh, some uh, fish and veggies. Hopefully I can get it done next year. As soon as the, uh, the solar gets done. But I am a prepper too. I don't know if everybody realizes it, but I'm a prepper also. So... And that's what we do. Well, thanks for watching. I'll show you the uh, aerator and stuff next. Another cool thing about the pond, I was just on the phone with, uh, <clears throat> with, uh, shoot, I'm sorry, my memory's messed up. DIY Solar Homestead. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just thinking too much. But uh, check out these little fern things around the pond. Let me know if you think you know where I do, what they are. I'd like to find out. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to call it the end. Phone's about ready to die. So, uh, everybody check out DIY Solar Homestead. If you're seeing this, check him out. Sub to him. He's a good guy. Looking forward to collaboration this weekend. See you guys.